friends welcome to tech ark it youtube channel in this video session we are going to see about um, how to make a template script so that every time whenever you wanted to create a script so automatically that template will create with the file name or whatever the file name we give okay so because this is a little bit a professional way to do it but so whenever you you wanted to uh, example say if you go to the scripts here so you can also make some files right like uh, we i and uh, create some files but that files do not have anything so every time you have to add shebang and you have to add some little bit details about your uh, author of a file and when the file is created and when the file is modified all the stuff okay so instead of doing that what we are going to going to do over here is that just uh, uh, create some template script automatically whenever we type template and provide the file name so it's create uh, our template file automatically on the location so that is helpful for us to create some scripts based on uh, no need to add all the details all the times okay so let's go ahead and create some file name called template so i am making some template so i am not adding any extension over here okay because because this one i am going to make it as a command now here i am adding the shebang okay then i am saying that i am asking the user or the user are, uh, we are going to use it saying that please provide file name you want to create and i'm just saying that um, i am i'm adding this the same line it should pop up okay the option e extended options and read that input what are the input is given by the user and store it in file file variable okay now i am saying that using that variable it's going to create the file in scripts okay dollar file what are the file name you given with add automatically the extension is dot sh again i am doing that uh, echo so same uh, okay this should be added into the single code because uh, which is which is not to be executed anyway which is going to be exactly added to the file okay and here so i will specify some variable over here that um not required to anyway, we have the file name over here right so slash scripts dollar file sorry dollar file dot sh so this line what it will do that it will create the file whatever the file is created and it's going to add the first one is that shebang value to that file the next one i'm going to add one more thing is that uh, what is the purpose of these scripts okay add purpose okay and append it to this file now i'm going to add one more thing is that what is the version of your script in the sense if you are creating first time then your uh, script is the version 1.0 something like that later if you modify then you can change your version file now i am going to say create created date when the file is created i again i am appending to that file one more thing is that modified date when is the file is modified okay date so here if i am adding the created date so no need to manually add this date over here right so i pass the date command over here which will automatically create the date and automatically add the date to that file so no need to 
add manually so modified date so modified date maybe we have to modify um, because all the times we will not modify the file sometimes we open the file and uh, uh, just look it up and uh, close it up right so that time it's not modified then so modify date to be added manually then again author name who is who, who created the file so it's always to be you so that add your no, name over here and uh, redirect to, to that file and uh, i'm saying that so this is what my template is then i say so the best practice is that my script is starting over here and redirecting to that file echo and my scripts ends over here and i'm adding the end value end to the redirection over here so in between this start and end we have to write our script every time so this is the sample template or the template which i wanted to make every time whenever i want to create some uh, sam create some script then what i do that i will just call this template and it will automatically create your file then just edit that file and write your script so it should be look like good options then what i'm doing over here that i'm changing the permissions to triple seven to that template file and i'm moving that template file to the slash bin so every time i can call that template so i'm using sudo over here i do not have a permission to move that file to the bin now the file has been moved to bin now just what you have to do here is that type template then it will ask you to create some file let's say i wanted to create uh, something like uh, hello world okay no need to add any extension over here because it's automatically going to add the extension and create our template file ready right see here hello dot hello world dot sh has been created now you can see that my script template is ready so by the time what you can do that hello world you can edit the file over here like this then add the purpose version something like this uh, one dot zero example my script is like this so this is the sample template file so i'm not going to do anything modification so here i'm just adding my script testing template file that's it so your script is ready and it looks like to be in a professional way of it okay now execute this hello world so your script is ready with the template that's about this this session thanks for watching stay tuned you can make your own template okay uh, not only these limited options so you have many more things to add whatever but you make some uh, template script over there so it should be easy every time whenever you are creating a new script or you are developing new script you just invoke that template um, command then it will automatically create your template for you that's about it thanks for watching stay tuned please subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos please follow us on social networking sites if you have any technical related questions you can ask 